Hello everybody, my name is Kekaka and welcome to Mermaid Swamp. Now this is a whole RPG game that I have seen a bit about before and it looks very very interesting so let's just get right in shall we? This actually seems to be a very good scary game. This game contains grotesque and somewhat sexual images. Please be mindful of this as you play. The author takes no responsibility in advance for any trouble or damages indirectly brought about by the game. Kind of the same warning from me, Sayo. That one had a lot of bad, bad content in it. Rin Yamazaki. What the? Am I underwater? Probably dreaming. What the hell am I doing? Probably dreaming. Who's that? Somebody there? No. No. Rin, wake up. What's that? Oh, I'm in a car. Sitaro Wagasuki. Stop sleeping already for crying out loud. Is that the grey haired guy? You my dad or something? Ah, oh, shut up. I was just taking a nap. That's so bad. When however not, you'd have been driving this all this time and you've just been snoozing in the back. Sheesh, not a hint of a lady in this one. Well, being a lady sucks. Not well, actually interesting in being a lady like for an early balding punk like you. Take that and shove it up your ass. Rise and shine, Ren. I'm going to guess you slept well, giving you started around noon. Yuka Kuichki. Kikuchki. Well, she seems nice. Yeah, but thanks to Baldi here, I'm more of a rude awakening. Quit your yammering, Yamazaki. That sucked. That was a horrible insult. Hey, Yuta, where are we anyway? You said something about kicking things into high gear, but are we in the mountains or what? Haha, <laughs> my bad. Are you serious? I don't know what this is either. Are you telling me we're lost? Yep, don't have the best clue where we are. Oh, you suck at directions. You gotta be kidding. You said the mountains were a shortcut, so I thought you'd do the way. Sorry about that. I mean, I did kind of know it first, but the fog just got so thick. Haha! <laughs> We're totally lost in the middle of the forest, in the middle of the forest. Don't worry about it. It'll be all good. Right? That ain't funny, shrimp face! It's exactly why I didn't want to go on a trip with your lousy old GPS-less car. Ah, we don't kick the seat. Oh, you kicked the seat. Well, now what do we do? I can't even see any signs. Because you're in the middle of the mountain. I am dumbass. Huh? The engine stop. You tell why did you stop? I didn't just stop while I'll try the engine. <laughs> ah crap. That is totally busted. Are you for real, dude? You dumbass! Oh, wait here, I'll go out and take a look. Alright, so I'm the chick here. What's wrong with you? Nothing looks wrong with me. Why the hell did it stop? I oh, know. It's a rock. Oh, such beautiful textures in the rocks. Oh, in the log. Hmm? S somebody there? Oh, no! I was just... Oh, hi, old man. Oh, that's a nice hat. Quite a surprise. What would you be doing up in these mountains, miss? That's an old coot. Damn it, don't freak me out! Because I'm an irresponsible little bitch and I'm mean to old men. We were on a trip, but our car went kaput, so I guess we're stuck. It's very unfortunate. Is there any way you could stay? Nah, if we can't get it running, I guess we'll spend the night in the car. This old man's gonna offer to let you stay with him. You needn't do that, my home is too far. Called it! Totally called it! You can stay there, even if it's summer's quite cold in the nights. Huh? For real? Well, let me talk to my birds. My peeps. My bros. That's a relief, thanks, old man. But you're shy, we don't want to pressure you. Well, I'm a landlord around here, you see. My house is much bigger than my needs. I would appreciate some young folks make use of it. I'm very grateful. We'll get the car fixed and leave tomorrow. How do you know, punk? Oh, I can see it now. Oh, that place is huge. Damn, that's a mansion. I kind of feel bad, Gramps, but thanks. Why are you calling him Gramps? That's so disrespectful. Oh, it's really roomy inside, too. You want to be rich, am I right? This looks kind of like the entrance to, um... What was it? Paranoia. That was another really good game. I didn't do a playthrough of that one, but I played it. <sighs> Sorry about that. Well, oh, it's really roomy inside, too. You want to be rich, am I right? I should have to be ashamed to say to this old place, perhaps. Come along and I'll show you to your rooms. Hmm, I'll show you to your rooms. I'll show you to your rooms, baby. Hmm, I'll show you to your rooms. 
sorry. <laughs> you can use this for your misprint. It's for the old fashionedness. It ain't nothing. Kind of like the whole retro thing. Thanks again, Gramps. I'm sure you're all hungry, aren't you? I'll cook you some dinner and tell them make yourself at home. So this is another part of the exploring game, so. Hmm? It's just for valuables, maybe. There's nothing inside there. I'm trying to steal this old man's shit. What kind of person are you? Nothing inside, nothing inside, electrical outlet, fireplace. <sighs> I'm just for the auto, guys. I'm tired. What's in here? Hey, hey, Gromps. Hmm, don't have much food on hand for guests. So chicken and egg and rice be alright? Yes, because we're staying with you. I kind of prefer something beefier. Like, literally beefier. Unfortunately, I'm out of beef, and I apologize. So, well, at least... I'll eat anything in the stomach, or maybe on most stomachs. Haha, <laughs> alright. You're kind of a bitch. Fill with plates and cookware, kitchen waste. What's in here? Oh, uh, hey, Baldy. It ain't that old of a building, really. You see that other place out back? Now that's all. There's another mansion. One man tells me they built this one a generation ago, since the other one was falling apart. Hmm. Large swamp. There's a swamp out front. I want to go see. I want to go see the swamp. I can't move anymore. Well, that's one big swarm. Yeah. Hmm? Can't read that. This is a stone monument. Uh, a man did abduct from the seashore. Crap, I can't read this. Mr. Todd know about this old stuff. He's got more knowledge than he knows what to do with. What the fuck, old man? Cares about the monument? Did, did, did you just don't sneak up behind people like that, you little bitch? Don't do that, you creeper. Fucking creepies. Fuck. That's creepy. You don't do that. These are men. You gotta not do that. My apologies. Did you read the description? No, I couldn't make heads or tails of it. What's it say? It's a legend that's told around here. Legend of the so-called mermaid swamp. You mean this swamp right here? This one? A legend? It originated in the middle of the Meiji area. My family has governed this area since around that time. It's said the son of a leader descended the mountains down to the seaside and discovered a mermaid. So I'll show you right out of the gate. I agree. Ha, ah, well it is a legend. The man was so smitten with the mermaid's beauty that he took her to his mountain home. He created a fish type for her to live in and he filled it with water from this very swamp. But a mermaid in the sea cares not for swamp water. The mermaid grew weak and became quite ugly. Her clear skin swelled, her scales fell off, and her voice as melodic as ringing bells was reduced to a beastly howl. The mermaid took on a most repulsive form and subsequently died. How sad. And a mermaid's wrath is no petty thing. Young women have vanished from the nearby village and said to be the mermaid's curse. A such a monument was put up to mourn her. What do you think? Hard to call it romantic, but interesting nonetheless. Uh, sorry, don't know about all that stuff. Tell us Taro, he likes stories and shit. Oh, is that right? I well, prepared dinner and ask him to the dining room if you would. Fine, let's get to move on. It's not beef, is it? It's the rice shit. It looks kind of like goods. Hmm, delicious. Some great stuff, old man. Like, do you like it? You slow down a little, though. Ah, oh, the bath is free if anyone wants to use it. So tired from the day's events. Please rest yourselves. Okay. You can't go to eat? What's up? I guess I'm too tired to have an appetite. You okay? We'll clean up. You can get some rest. Alright, thanks, you two. Oh. Yummy, yummy. Y'all clean up now. We have to clean up after you. Do it yourself, yummy, yucky. Find a, find a better insult. Yeah, work on your name, Sawyer. That was horrible. Man, I'm stuffed. I'm ready to conk out after that bath. Into bed. Ah, nice fluffy bed. Mm. Mm. Oh, you're dreaming about water again. Huh? My hand to water again. Yeah. Must be a dream. I mean, I'm not drowning. My eyes don't hurt. It's a lucid dream right there. I'm in deep asleep. That crazy shit. Can't move a muscle, though. There he is again! So the buddy's there again. Who the hell is it? Stop staring at me. <laughs> I'll kill ya! I'll kill ya! I'll do it. I'll pop out of this lake and kill ya. <sighs> Got some good sleep morning already. I didn't even change clothes. Hmm. Is there food? Can I have food? No food, a stove, a sink. How much food inside was this? A rice cooker. Hmm, that's the Tato's room. Can I go up here? Maybe I shouldn't walk around too much. I want Grumps to find me and get mad. Okay, well, I'll explore a little more then. Oh, hi. Are you stick? You guys morning, wake up. Sorry, I'm feeling kind of cold. Can I rest a while longer? Right? You're going to be okay to push yourself. Fine, maybe I caught a cold because of all that fog. As you know, we just walked, like, just a little bit. 
I'm such a whiny baby. No one's in here. No one's in here. Wait a minute. I saw something. Is this a wardrobe to Narnia? Take me to Narnia! I want to go out of this game! I want to go to Aslan! If you guys understand that, then you are fucking amazing. Mm, it's in here. Oh, there you are. Don't get up early, we'll steal. Early, it's already 10. Oh, it's early. I'm up early. It's only 9.45 when I'm recording this. But anyway, I checked on the car and it's still not looking any better. Shouldn't be out of gas. So old, I wouldn't rule it out just falling apart. But whatever it is, how are we going to leave? Hey, what's happening here? Hey, old man. Yeah, can we stay a bit longer? As a matter of fact, I have to go to the nearby village to attend a memorial service for a few days. That's right. Well, we'll be out soon then. We we'll won't stay too long. Even without a car, we should find our way walking. We could just leave the car and take the train. Now, it's quite alright for you to stay. I'm the only one who lives here after all, and I would quite appreciate someone looking after it. Huh? Really? Yes, you want us to look after your mermaids? And you wouldn't get far walking in the mountains, certainly not in this fog. You're more than welcome to stay until the car's fixed. Just please don't do anything dangerous like walking around in the mountains. Oh, I guarantee we're going to be doing that in this game. We keep an eye on any things, keep an eye on any fires, we get to walking around in the mountains. Yeah, yeah, we know, we know. Jeez, fuck off. Go to your funeral. Don't die. Don't die. <laughs> so long. Well, what the fuck do you mean, don't die? Better get in the bath first. I hate going after the guys. Alright, so I'm actually going to leave this part here because that was an awful lot of story for. <sighs> awful lot of story for a very short time. I apologize for continuously yawning. It's just one of those days. So anyway, this is the beginning of Mermaid Swamp, and I will be doing more episodes of this because this is apparently a really, really good game. And I did a tiny bit of it during the live stream a while back, but I didn't get very far into it. So anyway, thank you all so much for watching. If you liked it, click the like button below and subscribe. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Laters!